Today I'm going to be demonstrating the process of intaglio printing. The things you need to do this are an apron, print making paper, a zinc plate, which I have previously etched, ink, I'm using Faust Black, tarlatans, disposable latex gloves, cardboard daubers, and I also have Q-tips and mineral spirits and paper towels. The first thing I'm going to do is put on my apron. Next, we're going to place the printmaking paper in the soaking sink. Next, I'm going to lay my paper into the sink by gently lowering it onto the water and pushing it down to make sure the entire piece of paper is covered. It's important to put your piece of paper in before you start any of the other processes because the paper has to soak for at least 15 to 20 minutes. The next step is to prepare the press bed. The first thing you should do is clean it using mineral spirits. After that, we're going to set the micrometers of the press to the correct setting. For this print, I'm going to set the micrometers to 2-0. And you simply do that by turning the dials. Next, we're going to clean the zinc plate using mineral spirits. This is important to make sure there's no leftover ink from the last time it was printed or dirt. Keep it out of your print. You also have to clean the back and edges of the print. After that, I'm going to Take some newspaper and lay it out on your work surface. And lay your plate on top. Now we're going to put on your disposable gloves. We're going to open our ink. And remove the film inside. We're going to use the cardboard dauber to scoop up the ink. And begin to spread it on the plate. Once the whole plate is covered, you can go through with the dauber and scrape off any excess ink. Scraping off the excess makes the wiping process much easier. Once you have scraped all the excess ink off, then use a tarlatan 
Which is this cheese like cloth. Form it into a ball. You hold it in your hand and start to, in a circular motion, wipe down the plate. When you're wiping the plate, you want to focus on the edges and make sure that you're not pushing hard so that you don't pull the ink from the lines of the plate. Now that I've gotten almost all the ink off, I'm going to switch to a paper towel. And continue to wipe with that. At this point, Q-tips can also be used for more selective wiping. I'm gonna wipe the sides of the plate to make sure that no gobs of ink will ruin the print. done wiping. Now I'm going to lay the plate on the press bed. Next I'm going to remove the paper from the soaking sink. And allow the excess water to drain out. Then lay the paper on the waters. The paper tore a little bit, but I'm just proving my print, so it'll be fine. Lay the other blotter on top of the paper. And then roll it with the cardboard roller. Our paper is ready. Next, I'm going to carefully lay my paper over my plate on the press and make sure it's smooth. Once you have laid the paper down over the plate, lay the felt over top and smooth them out. Then, crank the press and roll it through.
and slowly lift your paper from the plate. And we have our print.